So you may be able to tell from my shelves behind me that I love Doctor Who merchandise. So today I'm super excited to share with all of you the Doctor Who merchandise is coming out in July of 2022. We're also going to take a look at future merchandise as well. So let's get into the video today on the Doctor Who Guide, a community where it's all about helping each other grow our knowledge collection and connection with other Doctor Who fans. I'm your host, Alex Patterson. And if that sounds like a community you want to be a part of, then definitely consider subscribing. Thank you to everybody who's supporting us over on patreon.com every month as well as using the Amazon, eBay, and Forbidden Planet affiliate links in the description down below. It's a huge help. There are links to everything mentioned in today's video in the description down below. Let's get into the video. All right, so I'm going to start us off with the biggest merchandise release of July in my opinion, which is the Doctor Who Daleks Invasion Earth 2150 AD 4K movie release, which is coming out on July 18th. This is the 4K collector's edition, which comes with a bunch of different extras so definitely check that out as well as the blu-ray steelbook release of this movie last month we had the first peter cushing doctor who movie come out this movie is also getting a steelbook release in germany as well as on blu-ray and that's coming out on the 21st of july as well the german shada media book is coming out on the 29th of july last month the collector's edition version of this came out and now just the media book by itself is coming out at the end of the month and while we're on the topic i I figured I'd give you an update on the future German Doctor Who releases as some of the dates have gotten pushed out. The German media book for Survival, the title of which translates to Death on Soft Feet because of the deadly cats in the episode, was originally supposed to come out on the 29th of July, but it's now coming out on the 26th of August, as is the Terror of the Vervoids media book. And again, that was supposed to come out on July 29th, but it's now coming out on August 26th. Originally coming out on August 26th was the collector's edition media book of The Seas of Death, but that is now coming out on the 30th of September and two weeks later on the 14th of October just the media book version of The Seas of Death is coming out. We now officially have a listing for that. Last month the German Mind of Evil Collector's Edition media book was supposed to be coming out on October 28th but has now been pushed out several months and is now coming out on January 27th 2023. Coming out on the 13th of July we have the Australian Doctor Who and the Daleks 4K, Blu-ray, and DVD releases coming out to JB, Hi-Fi, and Sanity.com. The 4K edition of Doctor Who and the Daleks is also available on Amazon.com.au. So they're still getting the first Peter Cushing movie. However, we do now have listings for the second Peter Cushing movie coming out for Australian collectors on 4K on the 31st of August, as well as on Blu-ray on the 31st of August, and on DVD on the 31st of August. There are listings currently for all three of those available available on sanity.com.au, but nowhere else. Speaking of more Australian editions, we now have a release date for the Australian Doctor Who The Collection Season 22, which is coming out on September 14th on amazon.com.au and JB Hi-Fi. There are listings up on Sanity, but no release date has come out yet for the Sanity listings. The Abominable Snowman Australian Blu-ray is coming out on JB Hi-Fi on August 3rd. Amazon.com.au says the 26th of October. It could be either of those dates. I think August 3rd is the more likely, and there are listings up on Sanity, but no release dates yet. This is really making me wonder when the UK versions are going to come out on Steelbook, Blu-ray, and DVD, seeing as the US Abominable Snowman also has a release date of December 6th. I mean, when is it going to come out in the UK? It's got to happen this month in July sometime, I would think. But what we do know for sure is coming out on the 13th of July is the Eve of the Daleks and Legend of the Sea Devils Australian DVD and Blu-ray. We now have a date for those releases, which is very cool, coming to JB Hi-Fi and Sanity.com.au. It's great that Australian collectors are finally getting this release as it originally came out in the UK on the 23rd of May, so they've had to wait a long time for this. In the US, we recently got the Eve of the Dallas Legend of the Sea Devils DVD and Blu-ray. The unboxing is coming soon for that. That came out on Amazon.com and Amazon.ca on June 28th. And while we're on the topic of US releases, Colin Baker Complete Season 1 on Blu-ray is excitingly coming out on our October 18th hasn't been pushed back yet and the Galaxy 4 US DVD is still in my pre-orders it hasn't been cancelled but there's still no release date so I will keep you updated on that and speaking of releases that haven't come out yet we are still waiting on the collection season 8 standard edition re-release hasn't been announced yet but I will keep you posted as soon as I see any news of that enough of future releases though let's check out exactly what's coming out in July we have coming to amazon.com some CD releases 
releases, finally, including London 1965, which came out on CD on July 1st, as well as the Underwater Menace Target Novelization Audiobook, along with the Revenge of the Cybermen Target Novelization Audiobook on CD, and two days later, the Time Lash Sixth Doctor Target Novelization Audio CD came out on July 3rd. On the 6th of July, Doctor Who Origins Number 2 by Jody Hauser came out, which is very exciting to see that. Doctor Who The Stones of Blood Target Novelization comes out on paperback and Kindle editions on July 14th by David Fisher. That's coming out on July 26th, though, if you're shopping on Amazon.com. There might be some signed book plate editions from Forbidden Planet, so make sure you search there as well. The Androids of Tara Target Novelization is also coming out on paperback and Kindle that same day. Also coming out on the 14th of July is Doctor Who The Fires of Pompeii Target Novelization by James Moran and The Eaters of Light Target Novelization by Rona Munro. The audiobook version of The Fires of Pompeii also comes out on that same day on CD and Amazon.co.uk, but on Audible elsewhere, read by Claire Corbett, and the same goes for the Eaters of Light audiobook read by Rebecca Benson. Amazon.ca gets some CD releases coming out on the 19th of July, including the 7th Doctor Target novelization of Battlefield, as well as the Penumbra Affair. Book lovers will be excited to see Doctor Who The Return of Robin Hood, a fourth Doctor novel by Paul Mars, coming out on the 21st of July, as well as Doctor Who A Short History of Everyone, the hardcover book comes out on July 26th. According to Amazon.com, the 2022 Doctor Who Free Comic Book Day issue by Jody Hauser comes out on the 27th of July on Kindle. It came out back in a physical format on April 5th and acts as a lead-in to the Origins comic series with The Fugitive Doctor. Coming out at the end of the month on Amazon.co.uk and Amazon.de on CD are some big finish releases, which include Doctor Who The Fourth Doctor Adventures Series 11, The War Doctor Begins, Battlegrounds, The Seventh Doctor Adventures, Silver and Ice, and The Ninth Doctor Adventures Volume 2. Now we come to the big finish releases, which we just know will come out at various points in July, starting us off with the Second Doctor Adventures Beyond War Games, which actually just came out at the time of recording this video, July 6th, available exclusively from Big Finish until the 31st of August 2022, which is the same case with Doctor Who Emancipation of the Daleks, a 12th Doctor Adventure available on CD and download along with Torchwood Restricted Items, Archive Entries of 31 to 49, as well as Unit Brave New World 1, Seabird 1, coming out on CD and download. And the last release of the month, Doctor Who Classic Doctor's New Monsters, Volume 3, The Stuff of Nightmares, all available exclusively from Big Finish until the 31st of August 2022. You can sign up to the Big Finish newsletter to get an excerpt of Brave New World for free, link in the description down below. And you can also check out for free the Big Finish podcasts coming out this month, new episodes every Sunday. There are also weekly deals that come out every single week, so you can check that link in the description down below. I still highly recommend that you check out the unofficial 1988 Doctor Who annual by Terraquius Distributors. I've done an unboxing video for it. Highly, highly recommend it. I've loved reading it. Oh my gosh, you gotta check it out. Candy Jar Books still has up for pre-order the Analysis Bureau written by Tom Dexter with profits going to the Disasters Emergency Committee Ukraine Appeal, so definitely check that out and support that if you have haven't yet. Doctor Who Magazine number 580 comes out this month on the 21st of July. There are no vi links available yet, but you'll find those links first if you follow Doctor Who Magazine over on Twitter. So I've got that linked in the description down below. Last month's issue of Doctor Who Magazine issue 579, it came out on the 23rd of June. Issue 580 covers the second Peter Cushing, including a segment called Flying Saucers, where Jason Fleming reflects on his father's Dalek legacy. There's a, a feature on Cybermen, 20 Years of Spare Parts. Zygons, The Fact of Fiction asks who's who. There are also news, reviews, interviews, competitions, and much, much more. And we also have our Doctor Who Chronicles update. The latest issue was 1967, which came out recently. So far, we have 1965, 1967, 1975, 1983, and 2007 represented in this incredible series. And you can, of course, now listen to all of the Doctor Who Redacted podcasts, which came out throughout April, May, and June. All of the episodes are available to listen to, so definitely check that out as well. All right, so here we are on ForbiddenPlanet.com. Starting us off is Doctor Who Origins issue number two. This is cover A by Harding, as well as Doctor Who Origins issue number two, cover C by Zan Fardino. Now, I'm sure that uh, cover B should also be on there soon as well. Coming out on the 11th of July is a pre-order for Doctor Who the Zygon Invasion. This is the CD of the target novelization audiobook, which this might actually get delayed
delayed because a CD for this isn't scheduled to come out on Amazon.co.uk for a very long time until like sometime in 2023. And we also see this listing for Doctor Who the Fires of Pompeii audio CD. And it says the 11th of July, but it's coming out everywhere else on the 14th of July. So I think that's when it'll come out here. And the same goes for the Eaters of Light CD. Torchwood number 60, the CD from Big Finish, is going to be available for sale on Forbidden Planet on the 11th of July, along with the Robots Volume 5, as well as Doctor of War Volume 1 Genesis, the Sixth Doctor Adventures Volume 1, and coming out a couple days after is the Origins Issue Number 3 Cover C variant, as well as the Cover B Photo variant, and the Cover A variant as well. The Eaters of Light Doctor Who Target Collection Paperback by Rona Monroe is coming out on the 14th of July, as well as the Fires of Pompeii to ForbiddenPlanet.com, as well as the Androids of Tara and the Stones of Blood. They just don't have pictures up yet. There might be, if you're lucky, still signed book plate editions of some of these new target novelizations from ForbiddenPlanet.com, so make sure you keep an eye out for that. They also have a listing for the Zygon Invasion target collection. Again, I'd be very surprised if that actually came out on that day. Doctor Who the Figuring Collection, issue number 223, Azure, comes out on the 17th of July, as well as the Elder Ood, issue number 222, and issue number 221 of Vinder. And we also have issue number 220, which is the Black Guardian, along with the Essential Box Set, number one, which includes The Last Dalek, Cyber Warrior, and Dune Captain. We also have the special 2022 Doctor Who comic release coming out on the 19th of July to Forbidden Planet, as well as the return of Robin Hood on the 21st of July. And we have the role-playing game starter set second edition coming on the 28th of July, the second edition hardcover, and the rulebook second edition hardcover. We've also got the Doctor Who Women's Fit t-shirt. There's also a t-shirt variant of this, which includes the double hearts and diamond logo, which are used heavily in the 60th anniversary announcements. This is currently listed to come out on July 30th, so that might mean that it gets pushed out later. Next up, we have the Women's Fit t-shirt and t-shirt variant of the Doctor and Yaz here. This is again supposed to come out July 30th. On July 31st, we have Unit Brave New World 1, Sea World 1, and we have this Women's Fit t-shirt of the Doctor and Yaz celebration, again coming out at the end of the month and also in a t-shirt. And we have the Doctor Who figuring collection mega issue number 11 Dalek. That is an insane price. Oh my gosh. And that finishes up our Forbidden Planet merchandise section. Again, all of this is linked in the description down below. So that's all the merchandise that I am aware of, but I'm sure I've missed out on something. Comment down below if I've missed anything out or if you have anything on pre-order, what you're most excited for this month, what you've collected recently. Thanks so much for watching. If you made it this far in the video, comment down below and use the phrase joyous July journey so that I know that you made it to the end of the video. Thanks so much for watching. Stay safe, wear a mask, keep growing your knowledge collection and connection with other Doctor Who fans. Albert the Adipose says hello and we both hope to see you in the next video. Bye!